Well, it's on to the playoffs for some prep football teams. The final regular season games were last night, but what about the teams who are moving on to the playoffs? The brackets decisions will be announced today at the WIAA headquarters in Stevens Point, and that's where Fox 11's Ben Cromwell is. Hi, Ben. How you doing? Hey, Pete. We're doing good. Um, the fate of 224 playoff-bound high school football teams is being decided right here in Stevens Point. Actually, in this room right here, all the WIAA officials are going over all the maps, trying to figure out which teams are going to be playing who. And joining me now with the WIA is the Deputy Director, Wade Lebecki. Wade, good morning. Good morning. Now, how did we get here? There's 224 teams. What's kind of the process of going through and matching them all up? Well, the first thing we do is we try to go ahead and get the scores from last night from the games. And we got our final score at about 10.56 last night uh, called in. And then Todd Clark enters them into the computer then we determine who the conference champions were. If there's a tri-championship in a conference, they have to declare with a tiebreaker who the champion. If there's a co-champion, they have to declare who the champion is. That goes into the computer program. He hits a button, and about 10 minutes later, it spits out our, our, our field. And now there was games last night. Uh, from those results, how much did that change the field? Did you kind of have a feel for most of the teams that were going to make it? We did. We, you know, we actually had uh, 232 teams that did qualify, and then the criteria kicked out eight of those teams. So by going through the conference championships, and you, those are automatically in. Unbeaten conference champions are automatically in. But when you get to the 500 teams, then you have some criteria that comes in. So it's the overall win loss. So four and four will get in if they're five and four. But a four and four, or a three and three, that's three and six, will probably be knocked out. And that's what's determined last night. We had some upsets on Wednesday. We had some upsets uh, last night. And it really shook up the field a little bit. Okay, and now we saw, the, I guess it's kind of the war room. Is that what you'd call it in here? Well, yeah, I guess it is. Uh, the whole staff was here last night. Uh, we start, once we get the field determined, it's broken up into their divisions. And then two of our, uh, uh, or three of our people went in there, put all of the schools on the map, marked the conference champions, marked the unbeaten conference champions. And then we came in and started putting in all of the, uh, uh, I guess, the circles around where the schools are. That's probably the hardest part is to determine whether a Reedsville is going to go up north or if they're going to go down south because they're right in the middle. They're on the east coast. You have to try to figure out where they are. And the hardest part, I guess, was Division Three, where all of the schools are really spread out. So they're going from Superior all the way down to Wausau, all the way up into Antigo, and that's a large area. So it's really kind of interesting on how you draw that. Then today we, came, we come in here and then we start matching them up. Okay, so we know what teams are going to be playing in the playoffs. Now they're just deciding who's going to play who, where they're going to play. And if you want to find out who's actually in the field, you can head to fox11online.com. We have the complete list of who's playoff bound. And uh, let me tell you, Pete, I went on there this morning to see if my alma mater, Green Bay Preble, made it. They yeah. had to win last night. Yeah. A little disappointed they didn't. Um, but, you know, we'll figure out who's actually playing uh, in a little bit, and once we do, it'll be on fox11online.com. Yeah. Well, thanks, Ben. Thanks for bringing it to us. And we'll be no previewing problem. the high school playoffs in a special tonight on Fox 11. Tune in at 9.30 for complete coverage and analysis of all the playoff brackets. Fox 11 prep expert Doug Ritchie will join Paige Pearson, and uh, that's a show you want to see tonight, 9.30. This is exciting stuff, like the selection committee, you know, for, the, for BCS, the, the college basketball. Now we got this, and we're there. Absolutely. It to oh, as we had a break, here are some highlights from the regular season.